In May 1963, something incredible left the assembly line at a Caterpillar plant. It was not just another piece of heavy equipment, but a machine that would go on to dominate its class for more than 60 years and counting. The 988 articulated steering wheel loader was born. At the time, the construction and mining industries were booming. Post-war infrastructure projects demanded bigger, faster and more powerful equipment. Caterpillar had already made its name with bulldozers, motor graders and track loaders. But there was a gap in the market for a truly massive wheel loader that could move serious material quickly. The Peoria-based manufacturer answered that call. When the first production unit came to life, it was the fourth model in Caterpillar's wheel-type loader lineup. But it was by far the largest and most powerful the manufacturer had ever built. Under the hood sat a six-cylinder CAT D343 diesel engine producing 300 flywheel horsepower. That was serious output for 1963. The machine could scoop up five cubic yards of material in a single pass and dump it into waiting trucks with ease. The introduction made waves. By 1968, just five years after launch, the engine output climbed to 325 horse. The bucket capacity grew to six cubic yards. These weren't minor tweaks. They represented Caterpillar's commitment to pushing the 988 further. The machine came equipped with a three-speed power shift transmission, allowing operators to move through gears smoothly while keeping their focus on the work ahead. The articulated steering gave it maneuverability that rigid frame loaders simply couldn't match. Contractors and mining operators took notice immediately. The loader earned a reputation for productivity and reliability that spread across job sites worldwide. Fifteen years after the original launch, Caterpillar unveiled the B upgrade in 1978. This wasn't just an update, it was a significant leap forward. The new model packed more horsepower, enhanced operator comfort and expanded bucket options. The results in the field were undeniable. A mining operation in West Germany ran a head-to-head -head comparison between the 88B and a competitor's machine loading slag. The CAT led by 15%. In Australia, a quarry reported a 25% production increase loading shot basalt rock after switching to the B series. These weren't marketing claims, they were real-world numbers from operators who depended on their equipment to deliver. The cab received a complete redesign. Better visibility meant safer operation. More ergonomic controls reduced operator fatigue during long shifts. For the first time, the people running these machines got serious attention alongside the mechanical improvements. The late 1980s and early 1990s brought new challenges. Environmental regulations tightened, fuel costs climbed, customers demanded more efficiency without sacrificing power. Caterpillar responded with the 988F, manufactured from 1992 to around 2000. This generation tackled emission standards head-on while delivering improved hydraulic performance. The upgraded hydraulic system meant faster cycle times and better fuel economy. Operators could move more material per gallon of diesel. Climate control systems and noise reduction made the cab more comfortable than ever before. The F-Series proved that meeting environmental regulations didn't mean accepting less productivity. If anything, the engineering challenges pushed Caterpillar's designers to find creative solutions that benefited everyone. When the G-Variant arrived in 2001, it redefined expectations for large wheel loaders. Power jumped to 475 horsepower. Operating weight hit 110,000 pounds. But that was only part of the story. The cab grew by 38%. Glass viewing area expanded by 60% operators could finally see their work environment clearly from every angle. Cycle times dropped by 6.5% compared to the F-Series. For four years, from 2001 to 2005, the G-Variant held the title of most productive machine in its class. Period. Caterpillar had found a winning formula. More power, more comfort, more visibility, more efficiency. The G-Series delivered on every front simultaneously. In the mid-2000s, Caterpillar introduced the 988H with a clear focus on specialized applications. The C18 engine with a CERT technology pushed output to 500 horsepower while meeting stricter emissions requirements. 
But what really set the H series apart was its versatility. The log loader configuration transformed the loader into a milliard specialist. Purpose-built linkage optimized performance for handling timber. Larger lift and tilt cylinders combined with extra counterweight allowed the machine to unload a full-length highway truck in a single pass. Third valve hydraulics enabled top clamp operation to secure log loads safely. Traction control and payload monitoring systems appeared for the first time. Operators gained real-time feedback on what they were lifting and how the machine was performing. From 2005 to 2013, the H-Series served customers across construction, mining, quarrying and forestry. Each application demanded something slightly different and the H-Series adapted to meet those needs. 2013 marked the designation's 50th anniversary. Caterpillar celebrated by unveiling the K-Series at the BOMA trade show in Germany. Half a century of continuous improvement had led to this moment. The C18 engine remained at the heart of the machine, available in configurations meeting Tier 4 final emission standards for North America and Europe, or Tier 2 standards for less regulated regions. But the real innovation came from the patented, optimized Z-Bar loader linkage. This design replaced the mono-boom configuration used on the H-Series and delivered something remarkable. Expanded versatility for tight spaces like small quarries and underground operations without sacrificing lifting power. Operating weight reached 112,574 pounds. Bucket capacity ranged from 6.4 to 8.4 cubic yards, depending on configuration. The machine could lift up to 20 tons. The cab featured a next-generation vital information management system with touchscreen displays. Reduced sound levels and the Caterpillar Comfort 3 seat with integrated controls made long shifts easier on operators. A rear-view camera system enhanced safety by eliminating blind spots. Options included the CAT payload control system for accurate weighing and CAT detect object detection to alert operators when something entered the work zone. The K-Series proved that six decades of development had only made the machine stronger. In 2017, Caterpillar made a bold move with the launch of the 988KXE, its first electric drive wheel loader. Built on more than 15 years of electric drive experience and four years of field testing, the machine replaced the torque converter and transmission with a generator, inverter and electric drive motor while retaining the proven engine, driveline and axles. The results were significant. Overall efficiency improved by 25%, with gains of up to 49% in face-loading applications. Load and carry productivity increased by 10%, fuel consumption dropped, and operating speed fell to 1,600 revolutions per minute, reducing wear. Maintenance costs were sharply lower. Oil change intervals doubled, filter intervals quadrupled, and powertrain oil use fell by 40%. Engine life increased by an estimated 3,500 hours. For high-hour operations, Caterpillar projected payback within two to four years. Since 1963, the 988 has helped more customers than any other manufacturer's model in its size class. That's not an empty boast. Its documented history written across quarries, mines, construction sites and milliards spanning six continents. The machine has evolved through seven major generations. Each one addressed the specific challenges of its era while building on everything that came before. Through it all, certain principles remained constant heavy-duty construction for multiple life cycles, articulated steering for maneuverability, bucket capacities matched to common truck sizes for efficient loading, powertrains engineered for reliability under demanding conditions. Today's 988 continues that tradition. So what exactly made the 988 the perfect loader? It wasn't any single feature, it was the relentless commitment to improvement over six decades while never abandoning what worked. The articulated frame design from 1963 remains fundamentally sound today. The focus on matching bucket capacity to common truck sizes ensures efficient loading. The emphasis on operator comfort has only intensified with each generation. Caterpillar didn't chase radical redesigns. Instead, engineers studied real-world feedback from operators and maintenance crews. They measured actual productivity gains and fuel consumption. 
They tested reliability across thousands of hours in harsh conditions. The 988 earned its reputation through decades of accumulated performance data across countless applications. Mining operations trust it to load haul trucks day after day. Quarries depend on it to process shot rock efficiently. Lumber mills rely on it to handle timber safely. Each generation built customer loyalty by delivering measurable improvements over its predecessor. For over six decades, the 988 has delivered on that promise better than any competitor in its class. The machine that rolled off the building LL assembly line in May 1963 has become something more than just equipment. It's become the standard by which all large wheel loaders are measured. That's what happens when you build the perfect loader and then spend 60 years making it even better.